Hi guys, I'm Rahul and today I'm back with another SketchUp model tutorial and in this video I'm gonna teaching you how you can model a wooden barrel in SketchUp. So let's start with uh, going to the front view then import the reference image. Please make sure that you check the user's image then click open and then draw this reference image on your canvas then start outlining. You can use line tool and the arc tool for outline. Then after you get this face, cut a top view, then create a circle, then select that, then move it into the center of this face. This is very helpful for doing the wall trick. Then select this circle face and then Click on follow me to then click on the other face, the barrel face. And after you get this 3D model and then move this reference image. And then next we want to create these rings. So for that clear select the top face, then move it up. Then create an offset, then delete the mill files, then pull it up using the push and pull tool. Then you will get something like this. Then make this bell as a component, press G2 make it as a component that's the shortcut key for make component then move this component down then move the reference image back in position then turn on the x-ray mode then select this component and then scale it Then create rings by duplicating this component. Press Ctrl to do that. And so I will do just two of this, then turn off the X-ray mode. Then scale it down. Press Ctrl. So you can scale from the center. I also do it for this. Tap a little bit more, scale it down a little bit more. That's okay. After you've done all that stuff, select these two components using the control key and the selection tool. Then move it up, then flip it along the blue axis. You can see flip along blue direction then move it down so that's how you can make the rings and for some extra stuffs, edit this component, then select this phase and use the scale tool to scale it in. When you do that, this action will copy to the other components also. 
so next we want to make this top ring for that I am moving this reference image then copy this ring up and right click and make unique then extrude a little bit using the scale tool then move it a little bit down and then I want to copy this to bottom also so use move tool to copy by pressing control key and then flip this along Camborn's blue then edit this component and select this phase and scale it in also scale it in a little bit and when I do it on the top it also copy it to the bottom also so here is your battle and and next what we're gonna do is texturing so I don't need this reference image no more so delete that and open the texture images so I'm importing texture images while importing texture image you want to make sure that you check this use as image then open it and write on your canvas then explore this and then what you need to do is explore this barrel component and then press B unique keyboard to open the paint bucket tool then press R to do the color picker then click on this image and paint it on this barrel and the barrel is now ready I want to do this for top face also and bottom face so next we want to texture these rings for that I am using the method textures in the SketchUp before that I again want to make this barrel component so triple click on the face then make component then select these faces then paint it using So there we have it, the uh, wooden barrel modeled in SketchUp. So this one softened the edges. This looks nice. To edit the style, remove the edges. Yeah, this is pretty nice. And then I'm gonna render it using Kerkathia. So before that, I want to add some directional light from here and from here and from there and also a little bit from here and then we're gonna do it render export to Kekatia save as yes. first I'm gonna enable the solar rendering so go to view adjust solo rendering then render okay wait some minutes to finish the render so the render finished fastly so we can check the rendered image yeah that's it looks like a low poly it's actually a very very good low poly so thanks guys and thanks for watching my videos I always check out of that so please subscribe to my channel for some cool sketch of videos like this so subscribe thank you